10 Surprising Things About Queen Elizabeth II and the Royal Family The world has recently seen the demise of Queen Elizabeth II. How much do you know about her and the Royal Family? From driving a truck during World War II to bathing in 7 inches of water every morning, the Queen was an interesting woman. She even had two birthdays. And the Royal Family is not far behind. Did you know Prince Harry was a cowboy or that the family cannot play Monopoly? Keep watching this video. Very recently, so many people around the world were saddened by the news of Queen Elizabeth II's death. She was an icon for many despite the royal family's dwindling power over the decades. People from all over the world look at the royal family with awe, not only for their riches but also for their lifestyles. The royal family as of today owns about US dollars 28 billion in real estate assets alone. The famous Buckingham Palace is valued at about USD 5 billion alone. And your wide-eyed wonder is not going to end there. We are going to tell you more. Fact number one. She married her distant cousin who her family did not approve of. Prince Philip, the Queen's husband, was not as well-to-do as a royal family. Royal biographer A. N. Wilson said that the Queen's family thought Prince Philip, a naval officer then, was not the right person for a Queen to get married to. Prince Philip was known for his goofy humour and that might not look the best on the husband of a Queen, her advisors said. But history shows how the same sense of humour attracted the love and attention of so many people across the globe. The Queen did not heed the advice and got married to him anyway, for love. They had met each other when he was 18 and she was 17 at the Britannia Royal Navy College in 1939, when the Queen was touring the grounds. Since then, their romance began. They also exchanged letters throughout the war years. Fact number 2. Queen Elizabeth II owned all the swans in the United Kingdom. Apart from having a love for the dog breed Corgi and having dolphins as pets, the Queen also owned all the unmarked mute swans swimming in the waters of England and Wales. You'd be surprised to know that she also technically owned a bunch of other animals. The law about the swans was created because back in the day, swans were a prized delicacy and rare, served at royal banquets. An official Queen Swan Marker monitors the health of these swans even today. Next, let's go to fact number 3. She drove a truck during World War II. During World War II, the Queen served in the Auxiliary Territorial Service. And she did not mind the danger or to get her hands dirty. She not only drove a truck during the war, but also was a trained truck mechanic. She was just a teenager then and was the only female royal family member to have served her country during the war. Fact number four. She bathed in exactly seven inches of water every morning. Yes, that's true. In the mornings when the queen took tub baths, her personal maid would draw her a bath that had to have the right temperature and the water could not be more than 7 inches. The temperature was tested with a wooden case thermometer before the queen stepped into bathe. She also bathed at sharp 8am every morning and woke up while listening to BBC Radio 4's Today programme, followed by a piping hot cup of morning tea. Now on to fact number 5. Queen alone holds six world records to her name. Impressive, right? She has her name in the Guinness Book of World Records for being the longest reigning queen and when was alive, she was the longest reigning living monarch ever. In 2012, with her net worth amounting to US dollars 504 million, she also became the world's wealthiest queen. Apart from this, she was the oldest reigning monarch and the oldest British queen. But the most interesting record she holds is the next one. For most currencies featuring the same individual, her face was featured on the currencies of 33 different countries around the world, from Australia to Trinidad. Fascinating, right? We have more for you. Let's talk about the royal family that the queen left behind after her death. King Charles III and Queen Consort Camilla are the new monarchs. 
you'd love to know some surprising and unusual things about the royal family that are coming up next. Here's the first fact and we bet it'll make you raise your eyebrows or at least giggle. The royal family cannot play Monopoly. Strange but true, the popular board game of Monopoly is forbidden in royal households. According to a 2008 article from the Telegraph, Prince Andrew said that the game was not allowed in the royal household because it was too vicious. Now we all know how it gets when you sit down with your friends and fight over properties. Maybe the queen did not want her family to learn from that. Hmm, we wonder what the royals play instead. Fact 2. Prince Harry, actress Meghan Markle's husband, was a cowboy. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been quite the buzz since their interview with Oprah Winfrey. And yes, of course, also for their Netflix deals. But not many know that Prince Harry worked as a cowboy during his gap year. Very specifically, he worked as a jackaroo, an Australian cowboy as a 19-year-old. This was his first experience living outside of Britain. He mustered cattle on horseback and was paid the hourly wage of a cowboy. On to the next fact. A politician from Britain is taken hostage by the royal family every year. Yeah, we're not kidding. There is a tradition that dates back to the 1600s. Whenever the queen or one of her representatives enters the parliament, one of the MPs will be held hostage at the palace. Back in the 1600s, unlike today, the monarchs and the parliament were not always on great terms. To ensure the monarch's safe return, an MP was held hostage as safe guarantee. This is followed even today. Unbelievable, right? The queen did not attend the now King Charles wedding with Camilla. They were also refused a church wedding. King Charles III, the new monarch of Britain, was always in love with Camilla, a woman the royal family deemed unfit for him to marry. Consequently, Queen consort Camilla married Andrew Parker Bowles, and King Charles married Princess Diana. Later, both of them divorced their spouses in 1995 and 1996. The Church of England refused to let them get married there because Camilla's former spouse was still alive, and that was not acceptable to the Archbishop. The Queen, who was also the head of the Church of England, refused to go to the wedding because of the same reason. stating she was putting her duty to the church over her feelings for her family so yes she was not present at her son's wedding and that had caused quite the stir in the media talking about king charles and princess diana takes us to the coolest fact here's the next one fact number 5 the famous princess diana sneaked out and went partying dressed as a man into a gay bar We've loved Princess Diana for her boldness, haven't we? In the late 80s, she had a fun night out all incognito at a gay bar in London. She dressed in a cap, an army jacket and sunglasses and stepped out doing what most royals would never dream of doing. Her disguise was created by her frontman, comedian Kenny Everett, British TV actress Cleo Rockos and famous singer-songwriter Freddie Mercury. They partied hard that night and no one recognized the princess. We hope you enjoyed watching our video on the late Queen Elizabeth II and the royal family. Subscribe to our channel for such fun breaks from your daily routine. Get some cool facts to use as icebreakers the next time you're out with friends. Stay tuned.